Hello and welcome back to Yukimo Village, the Hot Springs, where we party all day and night just by just clapping. <laughs> <laughs> so yep, today we're gonna do another multiplayer hunt with Mido Chan. Hello. <laughs> Alright, so um have you had enough clapping for the past five minutes? <laughs> yes we have. Let's stop. <laughs> alright, alright. So um yep, today we're gonna carry on with the key quest for the um, HR2 and uh, oops, press the wrong button. So, my heart is just Rockara is just giving a bit more of a stretch. And yep, let us go. Next in line would be what would it be again? A Narga Kuga. Ooh, the Narga Kuga. Yep. So, um, to prepare for this, basically, we are gonna do a sleep bomb run, sort of. Not entirely, but somewhat. We'll try. Yeah. <laughs> so basically, um, the barrier of bow that I'm using it has the ability to use uh, sleep coatings. So once again, we're gonna try and put it to sleep, and bomb its face or its wings or its tail, depending on which is not broken. So yeah, here we go. Hungry eyes, hunt the Naga Kuga. Yes. Right. So as you can see, um. Mido-chan is now donning the Barrel set with Jinoga weapons. And I, on the <laughs> other hand, um, I still don't have my new set yet, so yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I am lazy, sort of. Alright, let us begin. So, in my single player village quest, I've already taken down an Agakuga. But this time, let's take it up a, a notch by taking down, by challenging. The multiplayer one, which is definitely stronger. And yeah, don't don't bother taking the sonic bombs. Okay. I mean, unless you want to kill yourself faster. <laughs> Why? Um, well, I explained it before. It's that whenever you sonic bomb him, he actually just gets angry. Oh. Like you just briefly. Stun him for a short moment, and then he gets angry. He gets enraged instantly. So, I mean, there could be a certain significance behind it that I do not know, but I'd rather not, not you know, <laughs> mess with that. Yep. Anyway, where shall we go? Uh, he's at at area seven or five, I guess. And oh my gosh, the jug is so annoying. Is he there? Nope. All right, let me check area seven. We can go and check six. Okie dokie. Let me get some honey in the meantime. Okay, okay. <laughs> I don't think he's at 6 though. Yeah, he's not at 6. You mean no, six? I mean 7. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm blind. <laughs> so is Could he here? Oh, wait. He's here. Oh, he just flew over, I guess. Yep. Okay. Just gonna pop down, pop in my mic seats. And are you gonna paintball him? Okay, you did. He's uh, letting out that cat-like roar again. So, uh, once again, I repeat, the breakable parts on this Naga is R, 1, his wings, 2, his face, and 3, his tail. So, you can, well, technically cut off his tail, but before that, you have to first break it. You have to break off the spikes on his tail, that is, to allow you to cut his tail. Oh my gosh, that was close. Yeah. That tail sweep of his is really, really fast. It's easy for you to train uh, dodging with. Ouch. But uh, that, that though, is uh, quite a pain to deal with. So yeah. Right now I have my close range coating, so I'm going to... Oh my gosh, that was oh, that was actually out of range. Alright. Alright. He's going to pounce again and ouch. I did not dodge that in time. Dodge that. That was close. Tearing down the trees. Flinched, yeah. Oh, he's angry. Yep. Gonna take the chance to quickly pop in the first aid mat before he gets to attack. So, as you can see, when he's angry, the tail spikes um, become really, really obvious. Like they're just all fluffed up and all. So, yeah. Oh, I missed that. Oh, sharks. And when he's angry, he likes to do a lot of jumps, like he'll do one additional jump 
and that amazing tailspin which covers quite a bit of range, even though it doesn't seem like it. What are you doing running around? Trying to get his tail. <laughs> okay, okay. His tail is too high. Can't reach it. Well, we'll try and uh, keep him down. I need to chew his head. Uh, well, you can just, you know, maybe break his head first or something, I don't know. Oh, there goes the last of my cool thing. Flinched him. I really want to break his uh, wings because breaking his wings does give us the razor, which is an important component in making his items and stuff. Although, to say the least, I already have his bow, so... Eh. Oh. Whoa. That was close. Oh, he's out of... Uh, He's not enraged anymore. As you can see, his eyes no longer glow red, leaving the ah that red trail behind. But he's still quite a threat to deal with. Yeah. Oh my gosh. Oh, the tail spikes. He's going after you. Never mind, I flinched him. <laughs> and he's gonna go away. Yep. So just gonna gather some honey while we are here. Oh, and he's going towards seven. Ooh, additional honey. What? Really? Yep. Yeah. Oh yeah, inside the three, the tree. Leading to nine. Oh wow, interesting. That's actually pretty far. Mm. And annoying. Ah. <laughs> uh. Means we have to go to six, seven, and then nine. Yeah. That's the closest road. There, I guess, yeah. Just to seven. Yeah. Let oh, us see. Oh, what? He's eating. Oh, Kelby's, I suppose? Yeah. Uh, I guess so. Uh. I'm gonna put on the sleep coatings right now to begin the sleeping assault. Oh. Hi! Thanks for landing right on top of me. What's he up to? Oh, stop moving. I'm just gonna rain down on him. Oh my gosh. Oh, wow! That bomb on the face! My cat is awesome. Better than your cat. <laughs> He's enraged though. And whose fault is that? <laughs> My cat was being awesome, too awesome that he got scared. And therefore enraged. <laughs> oh gosh, here we go. An extra pounce. I can I can actually help to break the tail part off as well, the first break. And I think I shot you there. <laughs> no, we did not. It's oh really? He should be falling asleep soon. Uh, I think we just broke his head. We did? Yep. Oh, he's Let's sleeping go. now. Yeah. Yep. No, the bomb! Oh, shoot. Oh, shoot. What happened? Um, my cat threw a bomb and it, you know, detonated oh. the moment he fell asleep. Oh, well, that, there goes the sleep bomb run. <laughs> <laughs> Stop kicking me out of the map! Oh, dear. Is he really dead my gosh, I guess um, my feline companion was a little too Excited. anxious about that, yeah. <laughs> Darn it, now we can't really out do the sleep bomb anymore. I'm a bit disappointed to say the least. Oh, something broke. Oh, his tail! His tail broke, we can now cut it off. He flinched again, oh! And then his wing part's gone, I guess. So I'm just gonna help cut off the tail. Oh, sorry. <laughs> Ow. Never mind, actually. I don't think I seem to be helping. Yep. <laughs> Whoa, that was close. So um, we broke his left wing arm. Time to break the right one. See if we can do it. There we go, we did it. I'm gonna try and contribute some, some slashing damage with my arrow. Although I'm I'm barely hitting anything. <laughs> oh else? Where is he going this time? 
Area 7. Well, I mean, since we're here, just gonna catch a bit of bugs first before I move on. And more honey. <laughs> yeah. Although, to say the least, I actually have quite a good supply of honey now, so... Don't really need to worry that much about honey. Uh, all these mega fishing, mega fishing flies, though, don't really need them. What are they for? Um, fishing. Other than that? <laughs> You can combine them to. I think you can combine them with other bugs to make different kind of baits, which are all for fishing. The bullfango are annoying though. Yes. I'm gonna be taking them out first. Ah, uh, before the naga takes me out though. Oh, uh, where's the other one? Is there one more? Yep, there's one right here. Oh gosh. The Naga is just hunting me while I hunt the booth angles. Okay, um, the booth angles are dead. Yep, thanks. Alright, now focus on that tail. It's jumping too much. Come on, I can cut it with my ouch. I'll cut it with my bow. Ouch, never mind. I said I'll cut it with my bow. Oh. I'll cut it, come on! Ouch! Out! I got hit by the massive tail slam. Okay, this is not looking too good. It is flying away though. Oh well. And it's going back to area 5? Yeah. My cat is just okay. doing the taunting because my health was low. Uh, okay. Yeah, so basically when my health is low, uh, my cat would taunt the monster to go after it instead. What's the attribute? Or um, skill that I think it's want? cunning. Uh, okay. Yeah. Wow. <laughs> oh, he's eating. Faster, let's take a chance and cut his tail. Ah! Cut the tail! Come on, cut the tail! <laughs> do your jump attack, do your jump attack! Stop hitting me! Oh, did we cut it off? No, it's not off yet. He did flinch though. Oh no, he's enraged! Darn it. Wow. Oh, I cut it off the bow! I did it! Nice. <laughs> now we can focus on killing him. Yes. Oh my gosh. Here comes the Oh out out out. I I thought I rolled right into that. Out. Close. He's he's probably very angry about me cutting off his tail, that's why. Uh his Wow, that was just right in front of his face. Alright, now we can just um Take him down without any worries. Oh wow, I missed that completely. Oh, time to try and aim for his face. Never mind, he's not facing me. Ah, oh, missed that as well. So bad. We actually broke all of his parts in like less than 15 minutes. That's actually a pretty good sign, except that I just got hit the second time. Ouch. I am so scrubby. Uh, is he is he gonna come for me again? Oh my gosh, you are annoying. He's he's exhausted though now. Oh gosh, I just missed another volley. What a sloppy play today. All right, there we go. He should be limping soon. He is fatigued though. And I'm just launching a lot of arrows right in his face. Oh my gosh, you Kony put a bomb. <laughs> Which I gladly blew it up in front of his face, so yeah. So whose cat is better? Whose cat is more awesome? Yo, fine, fine, your, your cat, alright, your cat. Yeah. But why, why does your cat put bombs though? I I have no idea. Is it is it cause of the loyal trait or something? Oh, you're not getting away, Naga. Not today, actually, you might actually. Let's see if I can bring you back down. Oh, I can't. Wasted. Anyway, pick up the... Um, there's a shiny item here. And his tail. Oh wait, his shadow, we didn't know... Ah, uh, we didn't know... Take note of where did he fly, and the paintball expired. The effect. Oh. 
Well, I'm pretty sure he'll be sleeping at 9 though, so... Yeah, just gonna head back there. Not too bad. We may actually be able to finish this quest pretty soon. Do you think it can be done in less than 15 minutes? Uh, I guess so. Which means we have about just one minute more to hunt him. <laughs> one minute what? and a half, yeah. One and a half more minutes. I think we'll probably spend that time finding him. I believe we can do it. Because he's oh. right here! Found him. He's yes. So I thought he was at Area 9. Why did you not follow? I wasn't looking, I was still sharpening up. Alright, I think I him before me. Oh well. I hope I can. Go ahead. <laughs> He is uh still Oh, he got angry now. Oh, I missed that. Why did I? Oh gosh, why did I miss that volley? Nope! Ah oh. shit. Nope! That was close. Come on, hit these arrows! No! No getting away! I just he's still angry. Oh, we did it! Yay. Nice! We did it! We did it! Yeah, within the 15 minute mark. Yep, we still had like 39 seconds to spare. <laughs> <laughs> I think like, one of the cats got the last hit, I'm not sure. I'm pretty oh. sure I got the last hit. Okay, okay, you did it, you did it. Yay. We shall see at the screenshot, the final screen ending. You'll probably see yourself and I'll probably see myself. Yeah, I know, but... Why um, not, right? That is true, but from that... Point of, I, I was behind you, so I could actually see if you were the one that landed the last hit. Okay. Or it could be a combination but of hits, I mean, I don't know, maybe. Yeah. Me. But I saw electric, on, electric, like, blue electric lines on him. Oh, uh, okay. Right Might before be you, he died. Alright, alright. Might all right. be my cat. Uh, like, I need... We have electric stuff too. Well, your like... honey. Honey. Oh, your cat actually uses the Jinoga weapon, right? Yep. So it might be your cat. Mm, might be. <laughs> Maybe. I don't know. I hope not. <laughs> <laughs> Konisha, not steal the light from me. We shall see. And now! <sighs> then again, I'm, it, I was inside. Kind of like inside him. So I don't think I can see anything. Well... From my screen, I can only see a small blue line and that's about it. <laughs> 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 I really don't know, but it, it it could possibly be you, but... From my screen, I see his head with that small blue line with yeah. a red slash and me slashing him. Ah, uh, then, okay, fine, it's you, it's you. Yay! <laughs> we did it in 14 minutes and 20 seconds. Not too bad. Wow, I got his razor. Nice. What's that's, that? Um, that's from breaking his wings. Oh. But well, in any case, so... Yep, that is all for this episode. We've taken down the Nargakuga. We still have plenty more to go, like the Nibble Snarf, the Ragan, and what else? Ragan? Rathalos? Rathalos. Oh, gosh, Rathalos again. Yeah, so, um. Okay. <laughs> Thank you all for watching, so. Stay tuned for more to come! I hope you enjoyed what you're watching, and, uh. Yep, we will see you again! I'm MH Geek, and she is. Mira-chan! Signing out.